It is time to get on our grind. We are back with the one penny to a hundred thousand dollar series. This is episode number 20. And my guys, we're getting close to the goal. Oh, you've got mail. I, 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 I got the internet like going nuts. So once again, welcome to episode 20 of turning one penny into a hundred thousand dollars in the thrift. If you guys have not been keeping up with this series, then well, what you doing? Subscribe, turn on post notice, and do that. But yes, I'm glad to say we have reached $50,047 in my account currently, and that account started with one single penny. So I am blessed. Thank you guys all for the support. We're halfway to making an insane amount of shmoney and an insane purchase. So I just can't thank y'all enough. But in this series, I love sifting, digging, finding cool stuff for myself to rock, to keep some things to flip and all of this. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get to the first spot. But before we do so, make sure you guys hit that like button. For every single like, I am donating one penny. And this like last quarter of the year's penny donations are going to the Ronald McDonald Foundation. I used to volunteer there. So hopefully that like that you guys drop does go to doing some good in the neighborhood. But yeah, without further ado, without further ado, dude, without further ado, dude, let's go ahead and hop in the car and get to the first spot and see what they got. All right, all right, all right. Okay, okay, okay. It's going down today, baby. We're the first spot, which is the Goodwill Outlet. I'm trying to find a bunch of things for some creative projects. I'm going to be working on very, very soon and also some clothes to sale. By the way, this video is sponsored by me and thriftheavenvintage.com. That is my website. Guys, I sell on there for all the people who can't make it to the whatnot live streams. So the majority of what I find today is going to be available on the website. Follow the Thrift Heaven Instagram. That's how you guys know when drops occur on my website. And that is where I preview some items that I do sell on the whatnots and on my personal Instagram. But with that being said, man, let's get in here. Hopefully we can find some fire. Good Lord, it's hot as hell out here, man. I feel like I'm walking on the surface of the sun. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Round one, fight! FFA, baby. What we got? A little real tree jacket, Bass Pro Shops. Oh, the Longhorn real tree. Equipped. All right, so that is round number one. We got a bunch of real tree invisibility cloaks Perfect. for all the people in rural environments. Redhead, University of Texas, all in brother. I'm gonna grab that for sure. And then these two, I'm probably gonna give away. And this is my shopping cart for the day. And I'm about to get a bunch of stuff that I'm gonna make some little projects with. So I'm gonna fill up this suitcase with some of that. So here's two more. This is like an abstract version of Twister. Looks like someone ate a Twister board then literally threw it up. And then you have the Bryce Canyon on the jerseys. I'll get this little tourist merch. I'm gonna get this guy as well for all you little businessmen and entrepreneurs. So I am successfully stacking up a ton of denim for a project. I love the questionable stain marks, but then look at this, man. Once again, this is like Chester Cheetah textured. Man, a nice Cheeto Puff Orange Carhartt Double XL Kangaroo Pocket for narcotics. Look at the little cut and sew action. Oh, the divine design. It's incredulous. Man, I have to get this though. This is a heater and it's just sitting straight out of grandmother's craft club. Y'all know my lady's a teacher, so this might be going to the Cantu closet. Sweet. I had this as a kid. This was like one of my favorite sets to play with. It is missing the piece that turns and drops rocks. That's sad. Actually, it's missing hella pieces. I was about to get this for my son. I'm reconsidering at this point. Never mind, forget I even said anything. Trippy. So this is a cool little Western piece I found. I really just like the vibe of this. I have a whole room in my house that's Western themed. So I do have to acquire this, man. I absolutely have to. All right, it's an obligation at this point. Hey, on the cool, I just found this fish food. I'm definitely gonna use this because I got hella hungry fish in my residence. Y'all know, fishes get you hella bitches. Facts. So a couple little extra finds before I depart. I've been stacking on denim. I found the Liberty Made in USA camo overalls for my son. I got some little tings to throw in orders. 
and of course a nice Mickey placemat to throw in orders as well. I'm going to do a Disney live stream so you guys just tune in on whatnot, bookmark the show. It's going to be crazy and this piece will be like a little free giveaway for all you guys with the babies. 59 pounds, 59 pounds of jeans. Dude, I got so much denim in there and I got a bunch of stuff to sell. Easily the best piece was the Carhartt. That was so random that was in there, but they only let off one rotation and I've been there like two and a half hours. So not a good sign, but that is the game you play. Luckily I came here for a little alternate purpose. So I'm excited about that. You guys just stay tuned. <laughs> So we just touched down at the next spot, which is the Family Thrift. Y'all know the plug. So I'm gonna go in, everything is 225. They have multiple outlet locations in the city. It's time for me to get my little dirty hands on some more vintage threads. Let's go. That true Americana, baby, that surf style. -na 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 -surf -set, dude. I imagine that with like some 90s surfer type of anthem vibes. But yeah, it's very clean stars and straps, baby. We really have the whole 4th of July fit, bro. You got the Speedo USA, USA, USA. Zipper pocket for the narcotics on the holidays. Come on now. I hope y'all see it because I see it right here. I see it right here, the sleeve never deceived. Oh, it kind of did deceive. Wait a second. I thought this was starter. This is still a cool little cardinal satin jacket. One bird, one bat. But dang it ain't. Where the star at? Where's the insignia? Damn. I could have gone to the woods to see this. Look here. This is what I was looking for on that cardinal's piece. Oh my. When it rains, it pours. Ask and ye shall receive. I'm a dang star boy. You got the essential starter, puffer. Oh, big logo on the back. This is what we dream of. This is what dreams are made of. This is what dreams are made of. Even the accessory section got that starter, despite the fact that it looks like a freaking night dwelling nocturnal insect really munched on this. I'm still going to get it. That golden state. Oh, then you also have the animated cleaning equipment. Big SpongeBob, no pants. Woo! Man, the Y2K like exploration grandmother fleece is nuts. It's on that nice teddy. What? All right, this is a crazy one, man. You have the Tony Hawk's Boom Boom Hug Jam Quicksilver Y2K Vintage Skate Hoodie. All right. And the reason I know the era is because it's right on the back 2000 and. Who? That is so hard. Then clutch up, man. You got the Budweiser with the duck. That's quacktastic. Speaking of Budweiser, this is a very random uh, pro bus driver crew neck bus driver with the frogs. I, I don't know, highly specific, but I fuck with it. All right, this might be the grail of the day. I can't even lie. This tee goes nuts. It says raise some cane. Bro, you have the WWF, burn baby burn, Kane wrestling tee on that TNT Dynamite. Holy Toledo, we are blessed to impress. <sighs> oh, no, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. You got the core heart for the ladies. Core heart for the, yeah, just for the ladies, for the women, for the whores. All right, beautiful brown blanket lined this thing looking like a nice little macchiato hey y'all know my country of origin is jort nation man you have the carhartt jorts what i guess these are courts man they're like canvas shorts beautiful hey we got that rural invisibility cloak right here baby that real tree carhartt dog dog let's get it hold on what is the size man that reveals so much about the garment. Beautiful size, extra large. That basically means one size fits most. This is heat. I've been waiting to find a real tree car heart, and it's about that time. Jackpot. Now, after it's been a long time, you're here, and never have I before seen the logo athletic kicks. My lord, with that air bubble, ooh. And also, I found this dog encrusted t shirt, cute as hell. There is clearly a contradiction happening on this garment. Made in USA, but it's Hermany, Deutschland, Deutschland, 
Deutschland? Deutschland. That's what I said. Hey, wear it, find it. Y'all know what my closet is. My closet is nothing but Harley. Oh, there we go. Coogee vibes. Expression. Oh, hold on. The sleeve never deceives. Please, please be. Oh my dick. This is an old school, bruh. Blanket lined Carhartt Detroit. When I say fine wine, this is of the finest stomped grapes. Like some child's feet went into crushing the grapes that were used to create the wine, that was used to stain the damn canvas, that was used to construct this amazing garment. Holy titties. Guys, I'm not gonna easily be able to carry all of these big ass jackets on out of here. We have Hello Carhartt. Now we got the Logo Athletic jacket to go with the show. The Pro Line, it's divine. Look at the jewel. Wow. My Lord, you gotta love the attention to detail. Whew, out of season, but I'll still pick it up anytime, any place, anywhere. Bam. That is not a vibe. How has this happened? Three for three, Australia. big old puffers, man. If you can't find something that matches this, honestly, it is on you. Even something green, because blue and yellow equals green. Basic color theory. The Apex One St. Louis blows. So much St. Louis gear, it never gets old. Occasionally it does. As if I needed another puffer jacket in here. Last and not least in terms of the puffers, you have the Pittsburgh Penguins. Again, I asked and I received starter gang. We're about to depart, man. And again, wear it, find it. Another one of my philosophical 10 rules of thrifting, if that even is a thing. Size extra large, Harley Davidson, man. Cusho, Houston, Texas, baby, 2005. You got the 07, Charlie Daniels. And then George, he ain't that straight. At least, at least I hope not, because with that smile, man, you could definitely gobble down this. Sausage. Anyways, man, I'm gonna get on to the next spot and see what else the day has in store for your boy. I love y'all, dudes. How beautiful, guys. We jumped in another thrift store real quick. A little pit one. stop in a family thrift. And I found two noteworthy things. This one is only $2 for all of these numbered balls. It's like a bingo game. This is like the lottery. It's like starter, dude. The Sultan of Swing, Marcus Maguirus. Size extra large. And then this jersey was funny, man. You got the blank concussion protocol. Seafaring mammalian. This $6. <laughs> if you squint, close your eyes, imagine hard enough. This could be Dennis Marino. This could be Zachary Thomas. This could be Ricardo Williams. Any of those people is fine. But yeah, six bucks for the blank champion. That's very weird. I'm gonna get this dude for two. And I think that's it. Guys, I was sorely mistaken, man. There's a pile of jorts on the ground. Y'all know it's Jort Nation. You have the size 36 by 32 Levi's orange tab. Jorts for the summertime. Cool price of seven dollars. Let's freaking go. A little bit of wear right here in the sausage nether region. Hey, then we have another one in the pants department. Unfortunately, these fire resistant Carhartt pants smell like cat piss. They're like $6 and I don't know if I can even hold them for a prolonged period of time. They smell so bad and slightly reproductive in the feline department. Mm -hmm. I'm not even gonna lie, man. I'm pleasantly surprised that not only did I find one thing, but three items that are all pretty hard. Yes, and I don't think the Carhartt pants actually smell like cat urine. It was just something in the general vicinity. So that is very good. I mean, we're gonna find out if the van does smell like cat piss throughout the rest of the day, but hey, that's the risk you take. Bro, he is I and I am him. Wear it somewhat, find it, not all the way though. This isn't Harley, it is that hogs in ministry. What a sausage, bro. Biking for the Lord. Oh no. Well, that's not very godly. Hold on, let's see what else was in this guy's collection. The Cadillac T. Oh, the Orlando Magic Pack. Hold on. Oh, the Popeye Rap T. Oh, hold on. What else? What else? Biggest and baddest? Eh, I kind of asked. Oh my God. The contradiction built into this crew neck is unbelievable. McDonald's Young Athletes League team manager. Stop the cat. That's what I'm talking about. One for the hometown, 
one for the Jets. Guys, favorite spice, favorite brand, that nutmeg, put a little seasoning on it, okay? I can't believe it, man. I also found the Republic of Texas Harley Davidson snapback. I told y'all, wear it, find it, I'm definitely keeping this one. Sorry. All right, the most glorious piece in here is what we are signing off with, and that is the Star Trek 1991. LeVar Burton on the changes. Look at this graphic. Absolutely impeccable. Single on the bottom, single on the sleeve, single stiatch all around. Let's freaking get it. We out. We blessed. Whew. So Lord have mercy guys. We're back from the thrifting adventure. Y'all can see it is pure chaos in the office, warehouse area, studio, whatever you want to call it. I have a ton of packages that are going out. So I appreciate all of you guys for the support on the whatnot live streams. And of course on my website, thriftheavenvintage.com. In this big ass sack, I have all of these puffer jackets, man. Like look at all these puffers. This is absolutely insane that I found so many puffer jackets. And of course, take a peek, all the Carhartt and denim as well. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video whatsoever, please be sure to smash that like button. It definitely does help me out. And of course, every single penny goes to a donation, you dig? And yeah, stay tuned. Definitely follow my personal Instagram. It is Mr. Paul Can too. I definitely need some followers up on there. So go ahead and show some love. I'll do little outfit pics, some previews, and of course, some funny stories here and there. But until next time, live the dream, eat that ice cream. I'm locked, I'm loaded, and I'm out. I love y'all. Peace. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life. I rooster. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.